It is Sunday, and I just got back from the gym. I did 65 minutes, I think, on the bike, and then two minutes cool down. Um, and then, because I had time, I thought I would try something new on the weights. So I found there was uh, one function that will work my upper back, uh, shoulders, and upper back. And that's important because I don't have great posture. And if I want to heal my back, like I would do, all of those things matter. So, <laughs> so I did four sets of ten reps of the pull, the lower pull, and that works the back of your shoulders and the muscles of your sort of behind your neck here, but less so than the ones that are lower between your shoulder blades. I could really feel it. So those muscles definitely need a little work because I didn't do a lot of weight. I just wanted to try it. So I'll try to keep that in the mix. Um, I did do the, crunch, the weighted crunches. I did five sets of ten reps of those, but then also if you just use one of the shoulder pad strap things across your body and then you pull, you know, this elbow to the opposite knee, you'll get different stomach muscles into the mix. I did two sets of ten reps on each side. So ten here, ten there. 10 here, 10 there, and then my normal forward crunches. Um, there is a way to make the forward crunches more difficult uh, than I have been doing them. So there's the padded roller that you hook your feet behind for leg lifts, um, but if you unhook your feet and let them sit freely, your legs dangle freely from the chair, when you pull forward, you cannot use your hips and leg muscles to pull. And so you have the only muscles that will help you are your core. And so I did it that way today. And it was definitely harder um, because you do, you use your quads in pulling when you have your feet hooked. Um, and so I amped it up in that way. I did not increase weight. But I did do that, and it was definitely, it felt like a far more intense workout. And then, of course, I did uh, the normal leg lifts, too. So, yeah, it was like almost, I think I was down there for almost a couple hours. It was a long time. I got a little sunburn. You can see my nose. You can see the mark from my sunglasses um, from yesterday. But I'm okay. It doesn't hurt. My nose always gets red from the sun, um, so hopefully that'll fade a little bit before I go to work tomorrow. Um, but yeah, so it was a good workout. You saw my breakfast was oatmeal. Um, I don't know what I'm having for lunch yet. I've got pears and apples and salads and 
all kinds of things in there, so I'll figure something out. But um, it'll probably be a good salad because I've got, I've got all kinds of, I've got peppers and all kinds of things to make a good salad. So I'm going to make myself a salad and then I've got corned beef in the cooker for dinner. That's going to have, that's going to be with veggies too. So nutrition should be just fine today. I'm going to, I did some really good stretches in the gym before I left. I had to share the gym in the more in the early part of the workout, but I had it to myself in the end, and so um, I was able to get some really good stretches in down there. So first shower, I am gross. <laughs> um, tomorrow's weigh-in day, and I'm nervous about it. I don't know why. Well, I know why, because I've been working so hard. I've been working so hard, but I haven't been great about my nutrition I've been okay and I think oh, fine but I certainly haven't been as good as I could be not ideal <sighs> I didn't in, I didn't intentionally choose Monday as a weigh-in day but it's probably good that I did because it forces me to stay accountable all weekend long because if I blow the weekend Monday's gonna suck <laughs> so I would like to say that I was brilliant in planning it that way but that was by accident <laughs> anyway so I have to keep myself on point tomorrow's weigh-in day um, I do have a bunch of homework to do and it's time to get it done so I'm gonna work on homework and um, otherwise relax in this nice sunshiny apartment and enjoy the afternoon. So I hope you guys have a great weekend and I'll see you later.